Excuse me. Yes, yes. Hi, Prashant. Hi, ma'am. How are you? I'm fine. Ma Please take your seat. <laughs> Very expressive uh, resume. <laughs> I have you. to look at those uh, many things it's happening with your resume. You see, he has worked somewhere. Yeah, he worked he's having experience. good experience actually. I can see in his profile. Oh, fine. I just want Prashant to tell about yourself. Yeah. Good afternoon, ma'am. Yeah. I am Prashant Kumar from Guntur, Andhra Pradesh. Um, I have completed my B.Tech in 2019 in the branch of uh, Mechanical Engineering at uh, Guntur Engineering College in Guntur uh, with 63.12 percentage. After completing my B.Tech, I have worked as an AutoCAD engineer and supporting team leader um, at Apex Geospatial Private Limited, which is located at uh, Vijayawada. Okay. Um, there, my role was uh, AutoCAD engineer as well as after completing of six months there, I was promoted as a supporting team leader. So, uh, approx up to uh, two years I worked as a supporting team leader there. Then I resigned my job uh, there at um, uh, December 2023. So, from John to now, I'm, I'm taking cyber security course in quality thoughts. Uh, in BTEC, I have done a uh, project. Uh, it's an uh, ultrasonic testing and data sonic testing by using these testings uh, we can find the flaws in the metal oh. uh, we use uh, we use probe uh, we will have an uh, ultrasonic uh, testing meter so by when using a probe we will move the probe, probe on the meat or metal so when we are moving we can find the defects on the monitor okay. so by using these tests we can find the flaws on the uh, metal so including me um, there are three members my mom uh, my brother and me um, my brother is working in Bangalore mm -hmm. as an auditor. My mom, my mom is a school teacher. Okay, Prashanna, like uh, like your machine works, all mechanical things you have done, yeah, isn't it, yeah. in your project? Yeah. Now, where the cyber security is connected with your course? So, in 2019, I completed my B.Tech. And so, it's been up to like five years like that. And in three years, I worked as an AutoCAD engineer. Okay. Uh, in between these, uh, I thought uh, this AutoCAD engineer uh, won't satisfy me as in my career. So I thought of uh, um, learning some new technologies. So I thought of uh, learning Python as well, Python data science as well. But I learned those, but uh, uh, it even me uh, being satisfaction. Um, after uh, uh, listening to cybersecurity course, uh, it, me, it makes me Okay, it feels it, it makes me so good in career. So uh, for this, I am learning my skills in uh, cyber security acquiring. So you feel that it's like somewhere it is useful to you. Yeah, it's very useful. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you are a cyber security expertise person. Yeah. So uh, going to the cyber security, we have in a panel cyber security uh, like a sir. Yeah. So, so you can have a question yes. stream. Uh, so I see your profile contains certain expertise in cybersecurity, mentioning some words like vulnerability assessment, penetration testing. Yeah. What exactly is vulnerability first? Vulnerability, it's like an bug or error. Means uh, in website, uh, we will find vulnerabilities which uh, hackers can get into the website by using the some tools. So by hacking the website, uh, they can uh, steal the uh, sensitive information by uh, changing the data, or accessing the data, or extorting money from users like that. Okay. And uh, where does this penetration testing come in? So penetration testing means uh, it's like, uh, so when uh, you are working in a company, um, they will uh, give some uh, websites or something to uh, test. So in that area, we will call it as a pen testing uh, by do well. They give some information like system uh, information, your voice information. So by using those information, we have to do only the pen testing, but uh, not going further that like uh, uh, taking those inform sensitive information and uh, after after coming outside of a company and uh, um, extorting like uh, blackmailing those users to give money or something like. That. Okay. So, in your work experience, you say that you have worked from 2021 to 2023, 20, yeah. December of 2023. Yeah. 
it's been almost uh, four five months since then yeah uh did you resign the job or is it something like a bc recession is it a layoff what what exactly happened no no i resigned the uh, i resigned my job there i have already given notice period of for two months uh, so the company was satisfied with your work? yeah yeah okay you mentioned about these machines like uh, lathe machines yeah. and uh, vernier calipers yeah yeah what is vernier calipers used for uh that using um, we can find uh, some small things uh, centimeters to calculate the uh, do we have any other better machine than vernier calipers it was sir but i don't remember now let's say i want to find the diameter of this pen yeah can okay. we use vernier calipers for this yeah we can use okay what if i want to find the diameter of something like my hair which is much smaller yeah can we use uh, vernier calipers no for sir it? no but there is a device but i don't remember now it's been almost okay have you heard of something called screw gauge yeah screw gauge right yeah okay cyber security you say you have learned it yeah how far do you think you are competent enough in the world of cyber security in the context of job are you ready enough to take a professional role yes sir i'm ready but uh, as a fresher so it's been uh, it's like a uh, uh, new to the cyber security i've been learning many skills uh, vulnerability assessment and penetration testing so i need to uh, learn more as well okay so can up to this i can uh, crack a job with my basics too okay uh, because we spoke of penetration testing and vulnerability assessment uh, you are aware of network scanning networking and all yeah I okay know. can you tell me what is the port number that is used for smb server message block yeah samba port it's like 425 425 you sure of it yes sir i'm sure 445 sorry 4 445 sure sure okay uh, what exactly can be done with that any idea we can find the open ports of uh, using that uh, port samba port okay Okay, so you you think it is important? Yes, it's important. Okay. So fine. It's really we have a good achievements actually. So yeah. which well, like in all those achievements, which one you feel really happy? Like I've achieved those in my life. So till now, uh, so related to cyber security, my achievement is like uh, uh, finding security vulnerability in Coin Hacker. that was my first achievement but uh, i mailed them and i got a uh, reply also it feels okay uh, okay i find i will i can do this uh, vulnerabilities okay. finding vulnerabilities if i will be hiring you okay. how would be like you're a good asset to a company i have learned many skills um, theoretical and practically so in my previous company also within the short um, within the short span i was promoted as a team leader supporting team leader uh, considering those all i'm a quick learner positive thinker um if you give me this opportunity i'll give my 100% to the company with all my skills uh, but good actually you are answering uh, in a good manner yeah. so do you have any questions to us no 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 questions so you don't have any questions yeah. so are you ready to hear our feedback yeah sure ma'am yeah. Prashant, you are very cool person. First of all, yeah, thank you. Uh, but like somewhere, I was missing your facial expressions. Okay. When even the body language, sometimes you are not feeling that comfortable, isn't it? Okay. So you just little like small corrections you have, but you really have a good experience in other aspects. Okay. So I hope you can do all your level best in even in cyber security. All the best to you. Yeah. So you have any questions? Thank you. Yes. So regarding the subject. when it comes to technical uh, understanding of your subject you have your subject you are confident in what you are telling and uh, as you have seen the question that i have asked you you have answered it wrong but you yourself found out that it is wrong and you have corrected so that is actually a very good thing correcting your mistakes is a very good a positive thing which any company would require if you can correct it much quicker where there is scope of less error it is going to be very helpful make your foundational uh, fundamental subject very strong i think uh, there is no other uh, recommendation that i can give you technically you are sound enough okay fine thank you prashant thank you. all the very best thank you ma'am thank you